Today I would like to show you how to transform your new iPhone back to iOS 6. Um, so this can be applied on any iPhone, uh, the iPhone 12, iPhone 13, or iPhone 7, iPhone 8, as long as you are running on iOS 15 and later. And you can see on my iPhone 13 mini, um, it looks exactly the same, just like um, iOS 6 on my iPhone 4S. Uh, you can tell that uh, they look uh, very familiar um, including like the lock screen uh, take a look on the lock screen here it is exactly the same and now let me show you how to achieve this on your new iPhone first you need all of these apps that are listed on the screen and what you're gonna do first you need to install the themes um, iOS theme right there um, so go into uh, Moloco from Moloco, you're gonna find uh, something like this. So you need to scroll down, and after that, um, you're gonna find um, the iOS themes. You can see this one. Uh, tap on uh, the download button, and then uh, tap on allow, just like that. And after allow, you need to go back into setting, and you need to install this one. Tap on install. Enter your iPhone passcode. Now when you go back into your home screen, you're gonna find all of these new icons. Uh, make sure you rank them uh, one by one. From here you need a widget that make it look like iOS 6. And then um, you're gonna go into Safari. And from Safari you need to go into this link. I have provided um, the link in my video description. And from here you're gonna find a ton of uh, classic widget for iOS 6. So make sure you select the one that you like. Um, so let's say I'm gonna go ahead and select this one I can go ahead and tap on it and then you're gonna find the QR code what you're gonna do is to screenshot and just like that and after you screenshot uh, you need to go back into Widgie and from Widgie um, so now I'm gonna clear the slot first because it is a free version you're gonna go into uh, this page and then uh, scroll down a bit you're gonna find import Widgie and tap on import from QR code and then you need to select the screenshot that you have just uh, took it at the moment tap on add then you're gonna find this new widget so now go back I go into manage from here it is a medium widget because I select the medium one so they are small and large as well uh, for the widget that I have mentioned earlier so now select this one select the widget and then you're gonna go back, um, go into edit mode, tap on the plus button, and then search for widget. And you need to select the uh, medium widget that we have uh, uh, done it at the moment. This one, tap on add widget, and then you're gonna find a classic uh, widget right there. This is what you need to be done on the home screen. And then let's go back to the last screen on how I achieve it. Um, so you need uh, a shortcut called classic lock screen for classic lock screen you need to go to this link I already provided in my video description as well and then you're gonna find a classic lock screen uh, tap on view and then tap on download and it will redirect into uh, the shortcut app and then tap on add shortcut and I'm gonna I'm gonna replace it because I have already done that now um, tap on classic lock screen and then tap on download content.zip tap on allow from here you need to wait like about a few seconds tap on ok and uh, it will redirect into file app what you're gonna do is extract this folder by clicking on it and now it has been extracted so go back into shortcut tap on this one one, one more time and, so, and then select the uh, wallpaper and in my case I'm gonna select the iOS uh, wallpaper and um, tab on always allow and then that's it it should be done on your lock screen so when you take a look on the lock screen this will be applied on t into your iPhone and that's it that's how you transform your um, new iPhone into iOS 6 so from the lock screen and on the home screen as well thanks for watching and then we'll see you guys in the next one